What is going on guys? Dustin Yui here back with the Detroit Red Wings franchise mode. Uh, so we're kind of on a slide right now. We're 15, 23, and 3. And it's it's potentially time to make a change. Uh, so we looked kind of last time. And it seems that goaltending is our, I think, main struggle right now. Grice is just clearly not getting it. I mean, Bernie's not getting it done on, on backup either, but... 12, 17, and 3 as our starter. <sighs> Those stats are terrible. So I think that's one thing we need to look at. Secondly, uh, someone suggested to look at uh, the players who are struggling and who their least favorite coach is. So, I didn't even know this was a thing. Uh, so on favorite coaches, there is a common trend. So Maurice Sider and Franco. Uh, Zadina just hates everybody. Um, Ryan Strom, what do we got? Troy Stetcher and Franco, Nemesnikov, Franco, uh, Franco, Franco, <laughs> Franco, Franco. It seems like a lot of people dislike Franco. A couple, a couple of people dislike our head coach as well. So, I mean, maybe we take a look at that potentially, but, um, I think there's a common trend here. Franco needs to go. He's our associate coach. So. Um, I think I have a, a a good idea on a trade, so I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna deal with the coaching staff first. So M Franco, nobody really likes. Um, Takashi, I don't know if he's getting it done. I just don't know. I don't know if we have enough like salary here, staff salary. We have like a million free, and if we get rid of these dudes, do we have enough to get a, a head coach? I I don't know, man. I just don't know. So I'm going to see if we can reallocate some. Uh, whoa, that's not what we wanted. I'm going to see if we can reallocate some of our uh, operations here. So reallocate. Uh, arena, we just, I just upgraded everything. Not upgraded, but repaired, sorry. Um, advertising, we can probably cut in half. We can go between min and max. That gives us almost an extra mil. Scouting salaries, uh, we're at the very min. Scouting travels at the very min. Coaching budget, let's just bump that up to the max. Okay, so there's a little bit left. Let's put that back into our, uh, advertising. So we want to sell this this rink, right? Um, so it should give us a little bit more money, hopefully. And... Hopefully we can figure something out with our coaching staff here. There is actually, I was looking, there is a really great head coach available. Uh, his name is M. McClent, Martin Mc, or Martin McClement. So he's an A, A, A minus, A minus, B teaching, A coach influence. So I think that's huge. He's got an 0 4 no record. I think he was the guy that was fired by the Flyers. I'm pretty sure. I don't know if there's a way. Oh yeah, you can see. Where did he start? Yeah, Philly. He got, he got fired like right off the start. However, he's extremely expensive, 2.937 million. So I don't know if we can actually afford him. <laughs> um, in terms of, uh, what are we doing here? Backup coach. So for Franco, where's our teaching? There it is. Um, I found a guy in the bees area. The bees area. He's an assistant coach, though. I don't know if we can actually promote guys. So. Uh, that's kind of a question for me. The guys who have good stuff is all are all head coaches. I th think it was this guy. Yeah, this guy. So he he only wants half a mil. Um, his teaching is B and his offense is B. So I'm wondering if that would help. Uh, because like I said, I noticed that like Rasmussen wasn't growing. I'm kind of wondering if this is the reasoning. Potentially. So um, I think I'm going to offer him. Well, let, first, what's his name? Sorry. Uh, let's find this there. Solus. Okay, so if I fire Franco, we can fire him. Firing coach will cost you. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, he's gone. Franco's out of here. So now we have an assistant. Can we promote? Oh, yeah, we can. Okay. Do we promote Devos? He's a pretty, he's a pretty decent. Yeah, I think we should promote him. So I'm going to promote him. Can we demote our head coach, actually? Is that a thing? Because his teaching in offense is not bad, actually. Promote coach, NHL associate. Oh, please select a role to promote this coach to you. Ooh, maybe we do that. 
Hmm. Maybe that's what we do. NHL associate coach. Uh, that's not really a promotion, but <laughs> let's do that. NHL associate coach. There we go. So we pr we demoted Takashi. He's now our associate coach. Let's see if we can get this this stud coach McClement. Okay, let's see. Thanks for the offer. I'll get back to you in a few days. Okay. We gotta wait for this guy to get back to us. Uh, so the next thing is goaltending. I did a massive search. The only team that is willing to make a trade for goalies right now. <sighs> I don't know about this, but we'll see. Mark andre Fleury from the Vegas Golden Knights. So he's an 87 overall right now. He's still an elite. He is, he's a bit older though, 36 years old. Uh, but his stats are... Or his attributes, I guess you should, should say. Are much, 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 much better than Grice. Let's just take a look here. So, yeah, we're talking like mid, mid 80s for most things. Mark Andre Fleury is like 90s. He's got a couple like high 80s, but. And he's got two years left. So, uh, what are we willing to part with? 28 years old, AHL defenseman. Don't really need him. Boom. Out of here. Okay. Um, that's clearly not going to work. I don't know if Vegas is third round. We might have to give away our third round. But we do have three second round picks this year. Plus our first. Massive. So pretty big. Um, obviously the Vegas Golden Eye pick is nice to have. Uh, but a goalie is also great to have as well. So let's just see if they'll take this. Uh, not really to retain the salaries. Okay. Okay, let's see if they'll take it without the salary cap. Trade accepted. Nice. I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth as it were. So Vegas gladly accepts this particular proposal of yours. Okay. Okay, cool. I mean, I feel like we, we won that trade, but, you know. Okay. So we've touched up our lines. They're back to what they were. I accidentally did the best lines, and screwed everything up which is okay uh so flurry and bernie now Whew, look at that 87 i mean two years 38 i mean i'm okay with that maybe we can find find a replacement in the meantime eventually you know maybe we'll see uh so back to the coaching situation i guess we just need to sim a day and see what happens i guess and then whew, i guess worst case we fire somebody and look for a cheaper ahl coach maybe somewhere in the mix there um yeah let's keep it going so we got flurry mark andre flurry in the lineup big trade to start the second half of the season you need an upgrade on a defenseman i disagree with you kip that's why you're getting demoted okay let's keep going here i mean he might be right I am unwilling to accept that you've chosen to offer me less money than I feel I'm worth. And we lost our first game with Flurry. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I think Leonard's gone. Okay, Leonard's gone. Gives us a little bit extra. That might be the way we're going to have to do this thing. Okay. There we go. We offered him an extra 300000 See if it works. And a... Two days. I think it only took him a couple days to get back to us last time. No, nope. okay, advance today. We're playing Calgary here. We lost. Oh my goodness. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on, buddy. <sighs> We're going single coach. Sorry, guys. We have to make some space here. <laughs> this is not a good spot to be in. All right, what do we got here? Budget remaining. Give him exactly what he's asking for. Let's see if we can slim him down a little bit. Yeah. There we go. That is literally all the money we have, sir. Please. I'm looking for volunteer coaches out there. Does anybody have a dad that would be willing to help? <laughs> uh, advance a day. Please, coach. We need you. 
We're really starting off on the right foot, Pyre. You're offering me a role so ideally suited for my skills. Thank you. Thank you. Coach, we are being scored on way too often. Okay, like, yeah, I know. Agree. What do you think? We just got a new goalie. Goals against is something to keep an eye on. Um... <sighs> do we just... Okay, let's, let's do the promise. Check back in two weeks or so. We'll try my hardest to make this happen. Dude, I don't I don't know if we're going to make this happen. How much cap space do we have here? He's going to be so pissed when I don't hire somebody. Hey, we got a shootout win. Yay. Um, I don't know how much cap we have. I don't think we have any. Oh, we got six mil. Okay, you know what? Let's sign Chara. Screw it. Let's do it. We're going to sign Chara. Big body. Big body defenseman for half a season. Let's do it. We're going to acquire Chara. 43-year-old Zadino Chara. Like it. I like it. Let's do it. Sounds like an absolute plan here. Okay, let's let's keep going here. There we go. Big dubs. We're still getting scored on quite often, but... So we're extremely happy... To, yeah, okay. Perfect. Okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, stop, please. Okay, so we won back-to-back. -back. Here we go. It's a good start. We got Chara... Do we, do we throw him in? I guess we do. Okay, let's do this. Bringing in the, the big guy. Six foot nine. All right, Char's in the lineup. Okay, okay, okay. Let's uh, let's do this. New coach, new defenseman. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> I think we just go to the, the deadline, see what happens here. Just go for it. Connect four. Okay. We need to turn the season around. Is happy you kept his your promise. Of course, dude. I will always a Lannister always pays his debts. <laughs> a Yui a Yui always keeps his promise. We just, we just gotta keep winning. We need to keep winning. Okay, there we go. Oh no, that's still a point. It's okay. It's still a point. Come on, boys. Oh, it's still a point. It's still a point. It's still a point. We really got to turn this around. Like, these next three weeks are crucial. Oh my god, it's okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. There we go. Okay, not a good loss. That's okay. If we if we keep up this two to one ratio though, that's. Or if we can keep like a two to one ratio, I think that's good. Okay, big dubs. We're almost at 500 right now. I think we got a lot of work to do, though, to get back into this. Eesh. Okay. Two wins, one loss. I'm okay with that. No! Oh, we need a lot of points, dude. Oh, I don't know if it's going to happen. I don't think there's anything we need to do with the trade deadline. I don't think so. I'm going to say, I don't like that you can't edit your trade block. Before we head into the trade, I want to see if you want to update your trade block. Kind of. I would say a buyer. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Do we get offered anything? What do we really need to do? Bufflin's available. Okay. Sir Gaichev. I, I think we keep, I think we keep running the course unless we like... Um, okay, trade deadline. What do we got here? What do we got going? Okay, Larkin, Strom, Zadina, Bertuzzi, Mantha, Fabri, Polak. He's trying to pull his weight. Rasmussen, okay. Veronix, still awful. Uh, the Kaiser, awful. Trade alert, Ducks, Shattenkirk. What? Pittsburgh Penguins. Oh my gosh. Okay. Chalowski, Helm, Stetcher. I'm just thinking like third line. We got to do something. Stetcher. Oh my gosh, dude. What is happening? Darren Helm. Eight points in 22 games so far. Wow. 
That's helpful. That is extremely helpful. Uh, Bobby Ryan is a minus 22. I think we deal him. All right, let's try this. Bobby Ryan, Detroit Red Wings, third round pick for next year for pool party. <laughs> okay, hold on. Called up. Uh, okay, that's fine. <gasps> oh my god, they actually took that. What a bunch of idiots. <laughs> okay, we're done. We're out of here. See you later, Oilers. Thanks for the deal. <laughs> I I can't believe they just took that. That's unreal. Bobby Ryan for pool party and a or Bobby Ryan and a third for pool party. Christian Jerry Anaheim is placing Christian Jerry on waivers. Uh yes, I will claim him, sure. Are you crazy? Oh my god. That might have just been a gift handed to us. All right, lines are fixed. Pool Party is into the third line slot. We also picked up Tristan Jerry, who's, uh, he's apparently he's an 80 overall. I don't know if that's like a morale thing, but uh, yeah, so we put him into the AHL for now. I mean, maybe we just get rid of him at, or we uh, get rid of Bernie at some point. I don't know. Bernie has actually gotten better, so we'll see. But uh, we're, we need to keep, keep motoring here, so. Yeah, we lost a couple games before. Mm, I think we go to like here, maybe. Keep going. All right, okay. Okay, all right, okay. Sorry, Bernie lost what? Uh, keep current tickets. That's fine. Uh, okay. That's fine. Okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, that's fine. Three three wins, one loss. It's okay. Let's just keep it up. We gotta climb the ranks here. Oof. Yeah, we're like ten points back with playoff spot right now. We need to tear it up, boys. Oh no. <laughs> uh, that's fine. Yeah, we we need to rip it up. Come on. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to do it. I think it's too little too late. We made we made a lot of moves, but I don't yeah, I just don't think we're gonna be able to cut it here. Unfortunately. Uh so I guess maybe we just sim the rest of the season? Yeah, we're we're like minimum thirteen points back. Oof. So yeah, I don't I don't think she's happening this year. We get we tried though. We we made a lot of moves, man. We that was a crazy like <laughs> It's probably the most moves I've ever meet, made in a season, to be honest. Most moves I, yeah, I think I've ever made. Yeah, we're still like 13 points back. Yeah, there's no cutting it. We had to, we had to literally win like every single game. So unless some miracle happens, but I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's gonna happen here. Don't think it's gonna happen. Yeah, no. We're way too far back. Yeah, it, she she gone. It's over. Oof. We tried though. Hey, we tried. Nine. F what? A nine five loss. Oh my god. Oof. Okay. Well, that's the end of the, that's the end of the season. What a big dub against the uh, the Blues though. Oof. Okay, big dubs to to finish it off, but. Yeah, that's it. We didn't make the playoffs. We tried. We really, we really, really tried. <laughs> like I said, I, I don't know if I've ever made that many moves in a, in a, in a season ever. We made a lot of moves, man. Um, yeah, I don't know what happened. We just, uh, our, uh, our guys just weren't performing out there. I think we had some progression after we switched head coaches. Um, but again, I think it was too little, too late. We should have, we should have jumped on that coach right away when he got fired, I think. Probably would have helped. That's just me looking back. But um Hey, we had we had four guys hit sixty points, and I mean Larkin hit thirty goals, which is not bad. Um I don't know, what did he do last year? Yeah, I mean that's <laughs> significant improvement from the year before, so. And we we didn't finish last, right? So that's that's gotta count for something. Ah, Bertuzzi, Fabri, Pollock, Filpula, Peronic, Cider, Helm, Helm, finish with a zero, 
There we go. Where's uh where's our boy pool party? Five points for us. Oof. I was really, really hope hoping on him to do something, but clearly I mean he was only minus two in the last stretch, but I don't think he brought too much too much to the table for us. Goalies, flurry. Uh, I think we need to look at what he actually did for our team. Not so he went 17 and 10 and 2. I mean, save percentage. This is versus his, his stats that he had in Vegas, right? I mean, night and day. He came in, he made a he made a <laughs> he made a big difference for us. Two assists to oh my gosh. Does it not show shutouts? Oh yeah, it does. Two shutouts. <sighs> I mean he clearly made a big difference. I think it was just too little too late, to be honest. If we had him throughout the whole year at this pace, 100% we'd be in the playoffs, I think. So, we got him for another year. He he had a decent year for us. 27 wins. Yeah, I mean, he, he'll probably drop a little bit. but uh, Bernie, I mean, I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. He started as an 82 and he got to an 83. So, I don't know if that's some kind of weird... Oh. Some kind of weird chemistry or something? I don't know. Let's look at the... Let's look at the full NHL here. Entire league. Let's see what happened here. Alex Ovechkin. Oh my god. 35 years old. 114 point... 71 goals? What? Kucherov had 71? What? That's insane! Holy crap, dude. Oh, he went off. That's like... What? That's his highest goal total ever. I'm pretty sure. I don't think he's ever come close. 65 in his third year. That's nuts, dude. Oh, plus 47? Oh my god. Ovi. When he plays a full season, I guess, you know? Makes sense. 40, 48 and 68. Played a full year. <sighs> wow. He was on fire, dude. That is madness. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, dude. That's crazy. Yeah, that's nuts. Ooh, just bonkers. Braden Hopi for the uh, the Vancouver Canucks, though. Whew. 41 wins. Look at this guy. What a stud. Yeah, let's do a quick overview of our, our stats here. We definitely, like, improved 100%. Um, but yeah, again, it was just too little too late. I think... If we would have made these moves sooner, especially the goaltending situation, and like the coaching, I think that would have helped quite a bit. Um, we only had 38 power play goals. Oof, that's not good. PK was pretty rough too. <laughs> yeah, pretty rough year for the boys for sure. Okay, so I was gonna keep going, but uh, we actually have the AHL playoffs. So let's just do this quick. Let's see how far we go. Uh, obviously, we got Tristan Jerry in that. Let's see how this goes. Let's sim the three games here. Yeah, we do. We had a pretty good season, I think, the Griffins did. Oh, two one loss. Six three loss. Oh, that might be it. She gone. We're done. Oh, we won. Okay. Game five. Come on, Griffins. Oh, we won. We're playing the Moose. Oh, my goodness. We're playing the Moose. Let's go, Manitoba Moose. Griffins and Moose, baby. Loss, win, win, win. Oh, we're up. Okay. Hey, this is good for development for sure. Except we only have one coach. <laughs> Yo, we're going. These guys are going on a run right now. Let's go, Griffins. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's go, Griffins. Come on, baby. Let's do it. Colorado Eagles. Too easy, baby. Too easy. It's going to be great for our young guys, though. Holy crap. 11-3. and three. Okay, hold on. Providence. Is this the finals? I think this is the finals. Let's do it. See how we do. Come on, Calder Cup. Oh. Oh, no. She oh, we won. We're down 3-1 in the series. Oh. 3-2. <gasps> no. <laughs> That would have been an epic comeback. Okay, we're done. Let's go to the end of the season here. All right, baby. It's Friday, June 18th. It's the NHL Awards. So, 
Uh, the Washington Capitals won. Oh, they don't even have... Uh, they don't even have the cup winner from this past year. That's so random. That's weird, man. Anyways, why, why is that not in there? It's so crazy. So they have the Washington Capitals. I don't know which way you go. President's Trophy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. President's Trophy Chicago Black, Blackhawks? Really? Uh, Clarence... S. Campbell, Vancouver. So Vancouver and Washington play the final. What a battle. Vancouver just not... Not able to do it. I mean, you know, they had Ovi, though. Ovi was a monster. Absolute monster. I wouldn't... Do we... What do we do? What do they do here? Ice Hogs. Is there, is there player awards in the... Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see if we won any player awards down here. I think so. Nope. 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 No, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to NHL player awards here. Alex Ovechkin with the Art Ross trophy. And it was also just announced Alex Ovechkin is back to back EA Sports NHL cover player. The the cover curse definitely did not happen. Ovechkin put up 71 goals and is on NHL 22. Unbelievable. Maurice Richard, Clear, Kucherov, and Ovi tied it. 71 goals each. Crazy. Ted Lindsay, Ovi, Frank J. Selke, O'Reilly, Jack Adams, and Law, okay. Bill Masterson, D. Forbert. Uh, the William M. Jennings Trophy went to Koskinen and Smith. Interesting. Vesna, Malcolm Subban, okay. Con Smythe, clearly Alex Ovechkin. Calder Memorial Trophy, Alexis Lafreniere. Perfect. Congrats. Lady Bing, Braden Point. I mean, James Norris, Yossi. I mean, it, it, we, we know who's going to win the heart here. We know. Oh, oh, clearly. Clearly, Ovi. Ovi with the sweep, dude. He just won everything. They didn't, they didn't cut this one out very good. I can see the edges of the picture. <laughs> Ovi all around. Great year for him congratulations Ovi okay so that's it we're gonna we're gonna wrap it up there uh, we got retirement draft interviews and the 2021 20, NHL entry draft and we got to do resign and we got the free agency so we'll do off season next time um, if you guys enjoyed please leave a like uh, if you guys have any suggestions for the team please let me know I appreciate it uh, if you guys have any anything any tidbits any players to look out to in the 2021 draft? Um, just whatever you guys think. I, I I love seeing comments and feedback. So, and I try to reply to you guys. If not, if if I don't reply, I like try and try and at least work it into the video. So, appreciate it. I uh, hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you hopefully in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.